Hello, it's the One Pound Gamer again today, and today's video will be about last week's Bank Holiday Monday um, boot sale pickups. So there's quite a lot to get through, and um, in 10 minutes because I'm doing it in 4K. So you only have a 10 minute limit on my phone, um, so let's get on with it. So the not so good, well, not so important pickups a Star Wars R2D2 mug. Um, it's uh, it was only like one pound fifty, so um, it's an odd shape, but you know I like my unusual cups. So um, yeah, F one, not doing very well. Sorry. Um, and uh, onto the games. Um, went to a store and a a uh, little boy was uh, selling Lego Dimensions and the parts of the kit. I asked him how much for Lego Dimensions Xbox 360. He said uh, 50p. So it's in good condition. Um, Looked after his discs. This set. Oh, I asked him what he wanted for that as well. He said uh, £2. So £2.50 for a lot. Um, yeah, they're quite expensive online. As you can see, it's not all the pieces. So... Oh, that's okay, I've um, been wanting a Lego Dimensions set for a while. Um, it's on the 360, not on the Xbox One, but that's okay. So, um, and uh, Pops. Well, I've got two Pops, not at the boot sale. This is in Tesco. So, Crest Bandicoot, Dr. Neo Cortex, and uh, Power Rangers Gold Up. So, I have a limit on those, £5 or less. So, I've got those for £5, I believe. Um, yeah, that's my collection. And um, right, so back to the boot sale. I've got a stack of uh, Wii, DS, and um, PlayStation games. All for one pound or less. And got a loose disc, disc for, of Countryside Bears. It's a bit dirty there. For PlayStation 2, so it's half a scratch up. And for PlayStation 1, Axum Bass, or well, no, it's Bass, obviously. So we have a half a case. So half earlier, I suppose. Um, this one's bait for the PlayStation 1 again. Full case without the uh, front um, artwork. And uh, getting better. Uh, Jigsaw Madness. So. Um, Unfortunately, uh, it's been written on, I think. Don't know why you put Jigsaw on there when it's on the top anyway. And uh, Sky Sports uh, Football Quiz. So I have to find a way to uh, put these into my collection again. So a bit more moving around. Um, onto the DS, imagine Gale Band. I think these were like 50p each. So you can see they're in good condition. Um, sorry I'm uh, washing a bit today, um, I'm doing it in 4K so I only have a 10 minute limit on um, my phone, uh, what was that, uh, Jigapix, Love Is, oh, back in the 90s, early 2000s, um, yeah Love Is was everywhere, so I did whatever they could to get Love Is on anything, um, and uh, yeah, Super Mario Galaxy 2 DVD, so uh, this is quite hard to find. Um, not that expensive, but I've never actually seen one on its own. So now I've got the game and the disc. This is in good condition. So, onto the uh, Wii games. Hell's Kitchen. Um, been wanting this for a while. But it's quite expensive. Um, Pooper Funnel, Ryan's Rescue. Sounds like a dressing. Uh, yeah, all of these are surprisingly in really good condition. Um, Ghost Squad, sorry about the uh, reflection. So that's uh, really bumped up my um, Wii Games collection. Imagine Fashion Idol. So you can clearly see um, some friends. Cool. And you can clearly see or tell that. I don't mind what the game is if it's under a pound, I'll get it. So, um, TV show King Party. Um, 
Yeah, and uh, at the end of the day, it's all art, in a way. Um, Hannah Montana Spotlight World Tour, and that's the second Hannah Montana game I've got on a Wii now. Nicola, you victorious, talking the lead, uh, taking the lead, talking. Yeah, I can't speak. A bit dirty there, but if you can see that. Yep. And uh, see if the game is okay. Uh, that's a bit. That's not good. I think that's the only one, though. So, um, deal or no deal, the banker is back. So, uh, yeah, it's a little bit mucky. I can clean that. Family fortunes. This was big in the uh, 90s. So, um, and uh, Ben 10, protector of the earth. Protector of earth, I should say. So, uh, yeah, they're all good. Um, got some HD DVDs as well, 50p each. So, um, yeah. There's only one problem, there was no disc in Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. So, as you can see. But all the rest are in really good condition. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. So, um, yeah. Cases are in okay to good condition. Um, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. I'm going to be saying Harry Potter quite a lot. So, I like the way the HD DVD cases are. Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. Now, I've never actually seen any of the Harry Potter films. So, don't know much about them. Um, Too Fast, Too Furious. The uncut version. So, all in good condition. The Mummy Uncut. Music and lyrics. So, uh, that's a romantic comedy. 300. The double sided. See if it was blue, I wouldn't need that. The um, two, di di two disc special edition Transformers. Yeah, it's uh, quite nice, and um, that's also that's a two disc um, one. So quite a few people collect the HC DVDs, um, even though it's a dead format. Mind you, shows VHS and uh, Betamax. So yeah, there's always uh, something to collect. Um, Dragon Heart, you will believe. Flags of our fathers. Also a double disc or dual disc. The Heartbreak Kid. Fast and Furious, great film. And um, saw it when it came out on DVD. Um, Chronicle Chronicles of Riddick, never seen it. So it's a little, yeah, not the best, but. The skeleton key. Um, Charlie and Chocolate Factory of Johnny Depp. It's an okay film. Doesn't beat the uh, original. And Jarhead. So, at the end, I saw this. Um, a uh, four terabyte. My cloud personal storage. So, um, it plugs into your router, and uh, you can access it access it via the uh, internet via your router. So it's not Wi-Fi; it's quite old. Um, but as you can see, there's nothing in there because I took it took the drive out to use with my Xbox One for extra storage, and uh, surprisingly, I found a Western Digital Red NAS Drive um, 2.0 so for £10 that was great 4 terabytes so um, yes uh, this is the end of the video and uh, got 8 seconds so thank you for coming and um, hope you enjoyed the video and have a good day